The 4th of July holiday travel rush is underway. According to AAA, today and tomorrow will be the busiest travel days. Chopper 3 live over 42 in South Jersey in our area. More than 970,000 people are expected to travel 50 miles or more. Locally, 83% will drive to their destination. 10% will fly. 7% will take a bus or a train. The countdown to the 4th of July is on, but some people have already started their holiday vacation. CBS Philadelphia's Nikki Dementory is heading down the shore tonight. She's right there in her vehicle. <laughs> Nikki, how's the traffic? Yuki and Jessica, don't we wish we were with all of them too, starting their vacations early? I can tell you the traffic right now really isn't that bad. Welcome to the mobile weather watcher. I want you to take a look at the AC Express right, right now. Things are moving smoothly, as I said, and we originally drove straight from Philly. We did take a little break at Farley Service Plaza and then went down the shore. It really didn't take long at all. Really, the only pockets of traffic was around this city, and then it was pretty smooth sailing from there. So tonight, let's take you to Margate. It wouldn't want to see Lucy. Kathy McStay's got that right. Lucy the elephant had no shortage of visitors Tuesday. We are walking all the way from Vetner to come here to see Lucy. Andrea Emrich came with her granddaughter. For this Canadian, coming down the shore is a 20-year tradition. We're just north of the border from Canada, but we're kind of American too. Just steps away, the beach in Margate City wasn't too crowded days before the holiday. The best part? Just hanging out with friends. And of course, making memories too. We go in the water and we like getting like ice cream and stuff. While people did brave the chilly water, others played in the sand, and some already were rocking the red, white, and blue. Beachgoers say the plentiful sunshine with a little breeze couldn't be beat. Today's been beautiful. This is probably one of the best days because no humidity, it's not too hot. We like to get down here early, stay late. The best way to do it, right? And of course, you're taking a live look again at the AC Expressway. We're heading down towards the shore. Really, the traffic can't be beat tonight. It's pretty good throughout the way. Now we're going to start heading back towards Philly and see how that traffic's going to go because coming up at 6, we're talking all things traffic. If you haven't left yet, you might want to wait because the mix of rush hour and this holiday rush might get a little tricky out on the road. So that's all coming up live at 6 for now. Live from the Mobile Weather Lab, Nikki Dementry, back to you guys in the studio.